uh, paid attention to the royal wedding. You know, I've really paid attention to it because I'm going to tell you something today. That young man was chosen from his mother's womb. He was chosen to be king. And you know, all through his life, he was raised to fulfill that position. You know, I know that the wedding, one of the most expensive weddings in the world, $30 million they spent on this wedding for this young man and this young lady because they will inherit the throne that the queen sits on right now. But all through his life, he was raised to be king. He was raised to be king. But you know what? I want to take up a story from the Bible of a young man that had a birthright, was heir to his father and his grandfather's seat, Abraham and Isaac. Are you listening to me, uh, the Bible said that the, the two, uh, one of them was a Harry. Am I too loud? That speaker there is bad, so let's see what I can do to it. How's that? All righty. The Bible says that if you want to follow along with me, turn to Genesis, the 25th chapter, and, and, and I'm probably going to read some there, but the Bible says that the, the, they was twins. One of his name was Esau. Esau was the first born. He was supposed to inherit uh, that seat. Uh, but you know, there was Jacob, which was uh, uh, the one second uh, that, that uh, you, you know, the, the Bible said that Isaac loved uh, Esau better than he did Jacob because Esau liked the things that Isaac liked. Amen? Uh, but there was a day that Isaac come up, that, that Esau come out of the field uh, and you know what? Uh, was raised to do, just like a lot of times me and you are not worried about what God has called us to do. It will come when it's time. But what we have to do is we have to prepare ourselves to do the calling that God has called us to do. Can I get a witness? Listen, that was a royal wedding. There's going to be a royal wedding but that thirty billion dollars uh, uh, will touch, uh, and that will be uh, uh, the coming uh, of the King uh, of Jesus Christ. Uh, uh, can I get a witness? Uh, the wedding. The roll the wedding uh, around in your mind. This wedding, uh, and you know what? Uh, after the wedding, uh, and there they was. Uh, uh, with the, uh, being driven uh, by horse uh, and carriage uh, down uh, uh, to uh, wherever the, the rest of it was. Uh, but you know what? I, I've seen in that carriage uh, a young man uh, uh, that was proud uh, uh, to be uh, uh, what he was raised to be. Uh, I'm proud to be uh, uh, what I am uh, in Christ Jesus. Uh, uh, can In the 26th chapter, it said, And Isaac loved Esau. I 
Deuteronomy, the 25th chapter, the 28th verse, and Isaac loved Esau because he did eat of his venison. But Rebekah loved Jacob. Are you listening to me? And Jacob stirred porridge, and Esau came from the fields, and he was faint. He was wore out. He was like I was yesterday. He was faint. He was wore out. Are you hearing me? Uh, he had hunted and hunted. Uh, and, uh, uh, but uh, uh, you know what? Uh, you can go back and you can read uh, uh, the back further and you can read to where uh, uh, that bless God uh, uh, that uh, uh, the, these boys was uh, 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 struggling uh, in their mother's womb. Uh, and God told her, said, listen, uh, uh, there's two kinds of people uh, that said uh, uh, the one's going be stronger than the other, uh, uh, but the elder shall serve uh, uh, the younger. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, let me tell you something. I am the seed uh, of Abraham. Uh, Isaac, Jacob, can I get a witness? Uh, I am that seed. Uh, I'm royal. Uh, I may not be able to drive down uh, in a gold carriage, uh, uh, but I'm going to be walking uh, on streets of God. But so many people. I know the Bible tells us not to worry about what tomorrow may bring. But it gives us reason to plan for tomorrow. I'm gonna I'm gonna live somewhere tomorrow. Whether if it's here or whether if it's in the life to come, I'm going to live there. I'm going to be there. I can be what uh, I need to be uh, in Christ Jesus. Uh, uh, but the only way that I can be it, uh, uh, the only way that Prince uh, uh, William uh, uh, can be the king uh, is bless God. Uh, he's got to be a good follower. Uh, he's got to look at Grandma. Uh, I'm going to inherit. I'm royal. You may not be royal, but I'm royal. Do you know how I know that I'm royal? It's only kind of listen. There was a man called Jesus that came to this earth. What did he come for? He came to save man. Bless God. Again, we're talking about people. Bless God. We can go back further and we can find out where Daddy Adam and Mama, Daddy Adam and Mama Eve have separated us from the love of God. Amen. Listen, but Jesus come to give us life and to give us more abundantly. Jesus came to build the bridge across the great gulf that separated me and you from God. Amen. You sit and you say you don't know what you're talking about. As Jody was saying yesterday, somebody was saying it. Your money, your money gets to acting a little funny, and your change gets to acting strange. Then you look unto God. Right. Listen. When my pocketbook runs dry, when everything it feels like it's coming against me, when all hell uh, has turned loose on me, uh, all I gotta do uh, is get in my secret closet of prayer uh, and cry out to the Father uh, 